today's episode, we're going to be talking about the five dumbest things that's always posted on Facebook. Let's get started. This is about the most dumbest thing I ever see on Facebook all the time. It's when two couples have two different accounts and they tag each other. Meaning that they'll send these like sex memes, I guess you want to call them. Really? Because they're pretty much lame. They're going to sit there and tag each other. Hey boo, check this out. Oh yeah, baby. Yeah, 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 you know that, huh? You know how I am. Mm-hmm, yeah, let's we'll call it. No, we really don't want to see all that crap. I mean, what are you trying to accomplish? Oh, look at us. Look at our sex life. So what? Big deal. Everybody's got a good sex life. Well, some people got bad sex life. Yours is nothing special. So, stop it. It's a little windy out here. Let's go move somewhere else. Number four. Women post sex memes. You know the ones I'm talking about where, oh, if you nibble on my ear, I will rip your clothes off and blah, 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 and do this and do that. Stop it. You sound very, very, very desperate. And plus, if you do it on my page, I'm going to call you out and see what you're about. And I've done it a couple of times. And a couple of them got scared. Oh, I was just playing. I was just playing. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Stop being an attention seeker. That's not a good way to do it. If you want a man, do it the right way. Ask. Number three. The 15 to 20 times a day selfies. It needs to stop. Please. We all, we get it. We get it. We know what you look like. Okay. You're beautiful. You don't have to keep doing it 20 times a day. Maybe three times a day, once in the morning, once in mid-afternoon, one at night. That's it. And if you're going to do it, at least make it interesting. Not this whole damn car thing. That's all I see all the time, is people taking selfies in the car. I understand. You know how to drive. You're wearing your seatbelt. Good for you. Number two, stop putting your dirty drama out there. Nobody wants to hear all that. Nobody wants to hear how somebody screwed you over, how your boyfriend screwed you over, how your girlfriend screwed you over, how your family screwed you over. Nobody wants to hear that. You know what? That even makes you more crazier. I don't want to deal with people like that. If you got that much drama in your life, I got drama all day long. I don't say anything. I keep that to myself. Okay, this is the end. One thing that I'm really getting sick and tired of seeing on Facebook is politics. That's all people are doing is posting things about politics. No matter what you do, no matter what you say, it's not going to change the other person's mind. People need to stop doing that. It's a waste of energy for you, and it's all it's doing is negativity. It's getting to the point where everybody thinks they know everything, and it needs to stop. Because in this world, nobody knows anything. It is what it is. If you go, whoever you're gonna vote for, fine. Keep it to yourself. I know it's freedom of speech and all that stuff, but yes, it is freedom of speech. But you're abusing the freedom of speech. You need no one to shut the hell up. I'm sorry if I'm being rude, but it's getting out of hand now. This world's divided already. Stop what you're doing. Take a look around and look at the beauty in the world. Okay, because what's that old saying? Life moves pretty fast. If you don't stop to take a look around, you're gonna miss it.